Okay, in this video we're going to use the rule of a sequence to generate a sequence. So we're going to use a rule to find out what the numbers are in the sequence. So here's a rule of a sequence, it's 5n plus 2. So what this n is, is it's the position in the sequence. So if I substituted in 1 for n, that would give me the first number of the sequence. If I substitute in 2, that would give me the second number of the sequence. If I substituted in 80, it gives me the 80th number in that sequence. So to generate the sequence, if I want the first five terms, I'm going to substitute in 1 to find the first term. So the first term is 5 times 1 plus 2. And 5 times 1 plus 2, so that's 5 plus 2, is 7. So that's the first term is 7. The second term is 5 times 2 plus 2. So 10 plus 2, 12. The third term is 5 times 3 plus 2. So 5 times 3 is 15, plus 2, 17. The fourth term is 5 times 4 plus 2. That's 22. So what we're getting now is a sequence of terms like this. It's going to keep going, adding on 5 every time. So 32, 37, and so on. If I wanted to find the 100th term, so the 100th term, I'll have to do 5 multiplied by 100 plus 2, which is 5 times 100, 500 plus 2, that's 502. So if I kept going until the 100th term, that would be 502. So this is how we use a rule to generate a sequence. So here's another one, we've got 21 minus 3n. So in the same way, let's find the first five terms. So the first term is 21 minus 3 times 1. So n is the position. 21 minus 3, that's 18. Second term, 21 minus 3 times 2. That's 21 minus 6, that's 15. 21 minus 3 times 3. 21 minus 9 is 12. 21 minus 3 times 4 for the fourth term. 21 minus 12 is 9. 21 minus 3 times 5. 21 minus 15 is 6. And so on. So the first terms of this sequence, the first term is 18, then 15, then 12, 9, 6. And it will keep on going down in threes. So 3, 0, minus 3, and so on. Okay, this one's n squared minus 3. So the same, same thing applies. The first term is when we substitute in 1 for n. So it would be 1 squared minus 3. 1 minus 3 is minus 2. 2 squared minus 3. 2 squared is 4. Minus 3 is 1. 3 squared minus 3. 3 squared is 9. Minus 3 is 6. 4 squared minus 3. 16 minus 3 is 13. And 5 squared minus 3. 5 squared is 25. Minus 3 is 22. So the first five terms of this sequence are minus 2, 1, 6, 13 and 22. Okay, so see if you can find the first five terms of these sequences. So substitute in 1, substitute in 2, substitute in 3, substitute in 4, and substitute in 5, and that will generate the first five terms of the sequences. So give it a go, pause the video, and I'll go put the answer up in a minute. Okay, so the first one, we had 5 times 1, which is 5. 5 times 2, 5 times 3, 5 times 4, and 5 times 5. 3n minus 2, so 3 times 1 minus 2 is 1, 3 times 2 is 6 minus 2, 4, 9 minus 2 is 7, and it goes up in 3s, so 10, 13. 20 minus 6n, so 20 minus 6 times 1 firstly, 20 minus 6 is 14. 20 minus 6 times 2, which is 12. 
8, 20 take away 6 times 3, which is 18, 20 take away 18, that's 2, uh, 20 take away 6 times 4, 20 take away 24, minus 4, and it's going down in 6s. Okay, n squared plus 5, so 1 squared, 1 plus 5, 1 plus 5 is 6, 2 squared is 4, plus 5 is 9, 3 squared is 9, plus 5 is 14, um, 4 squared is 16, plus 5 is 21, and 5 squared is 25, plus another 5 is 30. And we've got n squared plus n here, so we've got um, 1 squared plus 1, so 1 squared plus 1 is 2, 2 squared plus 2, 4 plus 2 is 6, 3 squared plus 3, 9 plus 3 is 12, 4 squared plus 4, 16 plus 4, 20, and 5 squared plus 5, 30 things, one above.